you allowed yourselves to be even more empowered so that you can go forward and allow yourselves to flourish. This is only the beginning, and I know that you all want this to continue, and it can. It can through all of your hard work and all of your dreams, all of your blue moments, right girls? That are your blue, and you can turn it into a wonderful purple creation through all of seeing the special things in your lives and your red moments, which are maybe the not so good moments, you can also include them to be able to make it the color purple, right? As we all learn together and we can go forward in making so many different colors and, and changing our understanding so that we can feel even better and we can color the whole world because all of you girls have a heart for humanity. I want to encourage that and thank you for letting my heart matter to all of you. I, it has been the highlight of my every week to see your faces and the way you have touched me all is something that I will carry for the rest of my life. Things that I have learned through you and I can see all of you and I feel so much hope. Because you matter, because you allow yourselves to matter, because you listen to your parents who have been able to believe in your dreams, for them to have dreams for you, that you can go and make it even bigger for them, for the world, for yourselves, and add to this beautiful conglomerate of colors that we continually create. Thank you girls so much. So let's go ahead, Abigail, come up and receive your certificate, please. Let's give Abigail a round of applause. Okay. And we have Gabriella. Please come up and get your certificate, beautiful Gabriella. Our orange girl. Noelle, please come up. Yes. Paige, our beautiful tree. <laughs> Chloe. Yes. Thank you, Chloe. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Janice, thank you so much, Janice. Oh, yeah, Priscilla, purple. Our purple girl, let's give Priscilla a round of applause. Priscilla, please come up and get your certificate right on time. We have everyone. I believe we have all the girls, correct? Okay, perfect. Okay, thank you, girls. I drew this on myself. I love it. I put a Selena sign right there because I love Selena. Then I put a heart on my face because when you get paint painted, you just get anything, so I did that. Stitch. Because I love stitch. And I wrote stitch on the top. What I like about the program is that we could just communicate with other girls and draw and get stuff than just what you do at home. Favorite thing about the program was that we communicate with other people more friends and just talk to them because you can't go to school. What's your favorite drawing 
drew this one because I want to be a singer when I grow up. And um, I drew like a thought bubble because um, I believe in God and I think that if you believe in God, then anything is possible. Yeah. And um, myself with short hair because my mom said that I can't have short hair, but I cut it. <laughs> I think it works. <laughs> so, it looks good um, on you. <laughs> and so I drew that, and I also drew music notes coming out of my mouth. And I drew myself with no glasses because when I'm older, I want to get contacts. Because it's harder to dance with glasses on. So, <laughs> so that's what I want. And, um, I had a really good time in this program because I got to talk to other girls and it's been a long time since I got to connect with other people. Yes! Aww. I drew um, a city for my art class. Drew a hotel and the houses at the side and um, a road with some cars. <laughs> Drew myself and. Oh. Oh. Yes. <laughs> Drew um. A cat because I like to, or a dog because I like to help animals and I want to be a veterinarian when I grow up. Yeah. Yeah. I do a flower for my mom. A tulip. Okay, Paige wants me to talk about a little bit about the, the tree. So this is our tree girl. This is someone who is one of our taller girls or identifies as someone tall, which is great because she wants to be able to expand. She wants to be able to explore. And she expressed her incredible creativity in class. And in doing that, we learned how to understand trees and how to personify trees because she's a representation now that we'll never be able to unsee because of how precious she was and, and how much she shared with her work.